Ah, I was stuck in the pot for three hours last night. How come? That slop Chloe serves at her place tied me in knots. Damn, I ate some of that too. Well then get ready to hit the porcelain. If you've got the same thing I've had, <laughs> you're gonna pay. Fuck! I have been feeling a bit weird. Oh man, that's the last thing I need. I don't have the shard, so that's not gonna happen. I think I've paid my tab. You are Chloe talking gets nonsense. Pissed if you don't. I'll just... I don't even want to know. Let you go first, okay? You still have them? Do you really think that? You know stealing stuff's gonna land you in it. If someone wants Later, to all right. covering their bill again, I'll take it from your pay. Or... You know we can't afford shortfalls right now. You are talking nonsense. I am so sick Is of having to deal with this sort of thing. Be straight with me and you'll get the same back. What's going on? Hey, what are you doing here? Good Just for you. Get out it's of about here. time. What the fuck are you looking at? Buy a drink, get a life, or get the fuck out of here. All right? Any advice on how I should get a life? Don't take a job in this bar. Don't listen to anything anyone in this fucking town has to say. And don't waste the time of the few good, honest, hard-working people you can find here. Any more advice, you can pay for by buying a drink. What is this place? This is the place. The place of dreams. The place of love, laughter, and infinite possibility. If you want to forget all your troubles, and live the life your days in the desert have earned, then this is the place to do it. Just make sure you hand over your shards, or Mad Bob will be taking your hands. Clear? What do people call him Mad Bob? You keep using that name. You will make him mad. Just call him Bob, if you don't want to end up bleeding into the desert sands. Is there anything you need doing around here? Well, we always need muscle. But I don't have the shards to cover more staff. If you want to earn something, go to William. I'm in charge of this district, but he knows what is going on across the whole fort. Why have the outlaws stayed here in this desert? You think we're the only ones trying to take things? Albs, clerics, berserkers, they all take what they want. What is there to steal in Tavar? Sand and ruins and wreckage. So, here we get to be free. Teach me something. All right. Yeah, I think I'm done here. Well, if the blade is dull. Those ruins are still fully useful things, if you're looking at the right place. Just go and sleep on it. Goods are the whole heart of trade. Now, what's they the world without trade? Shards. You know that. Well, excellent. Another desert fly landing here thinking he's found something for free. You're just lucky you aren't a berserker. I hate those forest rats. They're almost as much trouble as the clerics. You have problems with clerics? Berserker, cleric. <laughs> They're both trying to squeeze us out of Tavar. They want to take us out. One needs men, and the other wants our land. Who wants your men? The clerics are short of new recruits. Didn't you know that? But they can forget getting them from here. They're not getting a single man while I'm here to stop them. I am William. I am the Duke's cousin. The Duke is in charge around here, and I'm gonna make sure he stays in charge. We are outlaws. A 
Are you sure you have everything under control here? Only an idiot thinks they have complete control of anything. This is about stopping all the little crises becoming big ones. And I have one small crisis that I can use an outsider to solve. What do you need my help for? I need someone who isn't on the radar when it comes to the district overseers. Some of them are pissed about something. I need someone to deal with that. Chloe told me you'd have work for me. Well, then sometimes she is a good judge. Listen to what I have to say, and then you go back to her. About these district overseers. Who are they? There's Big Jim. He's in charge of the arena. Chloe, she manages the entertainment district. Then there's Mad Bob. He calls himself the Scrap Baron, and you'd better call him that. People don't call him Mad Bob to his face. Ever. And there's Blake. He takes care of things that need taken care of. They've all earned their place, all proven themselves loyal. But they all have their little problems, and they all want more. Tell me about Chloe. Chloe owns her cut of the takings. That's not like her to skip paying her tribute. She knows she's lucky to have the position she has. So I need an outsider to make her pay up. It's a little more... diplomatic, coming from someone from the outside. And I need someone who isn't scared Chloe will shut them out of the entertainment district. Ask her for the shards, and find out why she's not been paying. If you can't manage that, at least make sure she pays her outstanding debts. What about Blake? Say, are you even listening to me? Blake is the only overseer who doesn't make trouble here. He takes care of his own interests and does what people tell him. I only wish they were all like that. Tell me about Big Jim. Big Jim. Good fighter. He's kept the arena turning a profit. Only now he's beaten everyone who's challenged him. He thinks he's invulnerable. I've even heard rumors he's claiming he will take over from the Duke. Those rumors are true. How do you know that? Because he told me himself. Damn you, Jim. I should want him dead. Instead, I want you to fight him. He needs his ego deflating. You're to fight in the name of the Duke, and make sure that you teach Big Jim a lesson before I have to shut him up permanently. What is the problem with Mad Bob? Mad Bob, yeah. That is its own chapter. He oversees the scrap deliveries to the fort. They are a big source of profit. Only now there isn't any scrap coming in, and I don't know why. The desert might be dry of water, but there's no way it's dry of scrap. Speak to him, and find out what's happening. I'm afraid he isn't delivering because nobody will work for him. But maybe it's something else. If you can get Mad Bob to start making deliveries again, I promise that will earn you a good reward. I will look into the problems you're having. That's what I wanted to hear. I run things for the Duke. Get things to move along more smoothly? Well, the Duke doesn't forget people who show him loyalty. Let me know how things go.